a K. Give me a V. Give me a K. Give me a V. People, people. Clash of words in social media about the responsibilities and criminalism of the charity. Oh, Lord. Two people with education like they clash up with war of words. People, you see, two me not have no knowledge of education. Me hide right behind this tree. Me no want no words catch me. Me stay far. Give me a hell. Give me a K, give me a V, three educated cash of the titan in social media, one running like them a mediator as usual. The K and the V clash, I wish one come first in the alphabet. Wanna tell me? And me see the hell jumping one turn mediator. Why go on speak my mind family, tell me why go on. Well speak my mind family, wanna know what they do. <laughs> and when me come with the new one, say, Uno Fedo they do. Like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Remember to hit the thumbs up when you hit the video. And please to watch the ads. That's all the channel generator revenue. Come. Me no want him no cash up and other shop scam. See how long you tell me put up cash up or something you can give me. And God bless the few where I give me. And it's not charity me I run. And when you no gift me, me take the gift and give back to somebody. You understand? Yes, man. Me na run no charity. Whatever you give me with because you no like me, you no support the channel. Yes. And whatever you give me with, as me say, a fraction of it go towards the, to enhance the backup channel. Adventure part of this the channel. All right. When you no give me nothing, no give me it with the intention say a charity. Mm -mm. Keep your money if you feel like a charity. You like what me I do, and you give me with whatever you give me with. Whether you send it to Western Union, Eastern Union, Northside Union, Moneygram, Funnygram, or no gram at all, or JN, or BN, or LVK, Cash Up, Dash Up, Zell, or Pell, what I have. Mm -hmm. I give you, give me. You support the channel. But to me, you can buy a pound of rice. I take the money. And I give it back to somebody at the, at the mountain where in need, not in greed, need. Anyway, people, this whole scamming thing going around. And me come to you, me talk about hell VK. But this whole argument about this whole if I scamming, you are going to the cash up system, we don't want to eat down the country there. I want another thing where they are for it. Larry the lizard, if you don't notice, she take it up and she run with it all the way. Because she claimed that she have evidence and, uh, and the lady and she was on 99 for four to five years now. And she couldn't run out on 99. With all the evidence she said she have, she couldn't run out. That simply means she have no evidence. But she keep down. She keep to talking about she beating down corruption. But you should have some documents of receipts from last year all along. And I don't know, I don't know why she chose this year to carry it out upon the it down a country. She come out with them. Where that simple tell you say. You have she say you have scammer one and you have scammer two. Scammer one is our more, our main focus. So why not come out with scammer one? Um, evidence first. Hmm? Why not come out with scammer one evidence first after four or five years? Because you don't have none. But I can tell you something. You see, you have corruption and you have corrupted. These are a set of people who is corrupted and say them a fight corruption. You understand? Yes, man. These are a set of people that corrupted and a fight corruption. You saw the two of them sound alike? A two different thing. You understand? Because if you know people who are dealing with corruption, from last year you have evidence of them. And because you want to bring down this one person, you keep all that evidence and you're fighting corruption. 
if you even want to bring down me for five years and tomorrow morning come and you find that person mixed up in corruption you go at that person if you have evidence at that person rest me till you get some evidence but i never saw it go you keep the evidence for a reason i don't know and then come out with it now and this big alabaloom in a social media but the people them now realize that you are also corrupted you now do corruption but you're corrupted because you corrupt the whole thing you understand me i said to know corrupted and corruption all right all said and done the jamaica constable force come out the other day and they are speaking about people who are renting their bank account and this girl Larry the Lizard take it up and run with it mixing the, the cash shop and the Zell and the pill and asking if it's not the same thing you're renting your cash shop and you're renting your Zell Zell and cash shop is a money transfer system right? where your money transfer direct to you unlike western union you have to go western union fee unlike moneygram you have to go moneygram fee it's not a bank account where your money go lodging where I come from proceed of different different crimes or whatsoever as the constable of force is talking about and the thing is Yes, people, so because the Jamaica Constable of Force come out with this renting a bank book business, they are trying to, you know, knit it together and question all kind of things. Because, you know, they might try all kind of way and loophole to get 99 connected to some form of criminalism and criminal activities. But me, street smart, and I have a lot of confidence and this is why I am out here defending the work she has been doing because there is no way she up in her farm I suspect I am a very keen observer I suspect she's doing nothing wrong the only thing them can say okay yes the government come now and say every charity must register and whatsoever whatsoever so basically, her thing might be a thing of the past unless there's a different route for her to take. But she was not doing anything anky panky before. When you see somebody can come out transparently and show you all them angle thousands and millions of dollars that them get from people to do XYZ and XYZ has been done on camera, nothing off camera. That them said the woman love phone everything she draw for phone because she gets so addicted to draw for phone. Sometimes I wonder how oh, when she go back to she have the phone, catch up a video and forgot so she go expose herself. The way she gets addicted to phone. And that's transparency. You understand? That call transparency. And this is where them come and them try everything because they can't believe said the woman anger so much money and so honest. I'm going to play them and make you hear them. A debate from the whole situation. So, stay tuned. The police believe the persons seeking out accounts for rent are actually online scammers who have defrauded the local hierarchy. bank customers and are looking for a safe place to stash the cash. In strongly discouraging the practice, as the clocking urge those bank account renters that the police will also be coming after them with the full force of the law. And you will be charged if once we have completed the investigations for um, un unauthorized access, making your account available for criminal um, transactions, we'll be also charging you for the proceeds of crimes act. And we yeah, listen, once you make your account, which is a bank account, available for criminal transaction, criminal transaction all right make me put it and say your paypal your zell or your cash app you make your paypal or your zell accessible to someone 
who don't have a PayPal or a Zelle or a Cash App. All right, let's say Cash App or Zelle, which is not, you know, use of Jamaican living in Jamaica. It's an overseas thing. And I have like, oh, I have a platform now and I get somebody to use their Cash App or Zelle for a meaningful cause. It's not a criminal activity. It is no money laundry. You understand? No money laundry, no criminal activity. You understand? Not to mention if the money where you are getting, the request of that funds, like an authorized charity then, and you read like the one down, you understand? The money where you get from that funds, once you use that money to do what you request it from the people that give you that money or donate that money to you, you have done nothing wrong. Not to mention if you are so transparent, like the woman at 99 Mountain View Avenue, where you see your money come, you see all your money hangle, you see all the paper write up with your name, and you see all your money dealed with for dealed where it was requested for. That is no criminal activity. You did not scam out of your hard earned cash. You understand? You fall in love with a program, you fall in love with an unregistered charity, you fall in love with a charity, and you wish to donate to it. Nothing on the your head, nothing on the your throat, nothing. Alright. Anyway, let's go. He just want to advise you that once persons are asking you to use your account to facilitate this transaction, you should not do it. It comes as six people were slapped with various fraud charges between January 1 and 25, 2024, relating to those charges. In total, six million Jamaican dollars was defrauded from local bank customers. In a statement, the police also indicated that in 2023, there were over 355 reports of online fraud and over 170 million Jamaican dollars stolen. We will be going all out to arrest these persons. As already have I said, we have arrested six persons. And so if you are one of them who... So you're here? Online fraud. Online fraud is what you call the, 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 the most popular word we are used now is scamming. Where you have these guys, they get lead sheets with people information and they go online, pretend to be their XYZ in their speaky spoky voice and they, you know, most times targeted the elder person make can just change direction the sun is going wow they most time target the elder persons you understand so they go online and talk and tell the people them all kind of things convincing the people them to give them them credit card number and xyz that is what you call online fraud that is what the jamaica constable force is talking about so when you are trying to mix cash up and Zell and those things with what the constable force, the police force in Jamaica is talking about, you are misleading the public just to get some form of message across in your favor. You understand? So, you don't need to get the facts straight. Alright? The lawyer wants to come on the phone soon, so you stay tuned for her. And the same procedure, right? Come the man, I mean I don't have to show you no man, me just come off you know. So come the people them don't know nothing. Up, you have forced them to say something in your comment section. So if they must say up, you know, come off man, I call your speaker. Call your speaker from the law firm. Is it the same thing as these people in Jamaica that renting out their bank account? No, it's not the same thing. Me I answer you. But talk already. If you did have understanding, you would have hear and know and listen and know what I'm going Start talking the cash up and the sell. The people them to do for know. And these people who are collect money for them to walk on the eyes. Because when they say after time, I own them and left in night. Them are this one, all the money where you see them getting at their name. 
them are this one at this minute, then say so I know them, them never get no money. People, remember, I can make it clear again and state it clear. I am on no side of these set of people who oversaw or done so. Where the whole involvement of cash up, dash up, slash up, fash up. But as I say, at times when I hear them come out, come speak, and attack crap, I am going to come out. Especially in this video, where it can be proven they are trying to tie 99 also in this whole argument. And because, as I said, the constable of force, which is the Jamaica police force, come out and hierarchy make a statement about this rent a bank book business. As I said, people, it's a total different thing because what the, 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 the law enforcement personnel in Jamaica got to understand is that most of these guys who are doing these things, not guys only, all female involved. They either don't have an account for themselves or they don't use their personal account. So what they do probably get people who would be less suspected to use their account to probably solicit the cash that they are getting through the system in them bank account. Right? What me I say, me not go so foolish. But then again, you have enough people who are wise, enough people who are street smart. That person might just have a fun and them hungry like that and them just take it, but they must see the consequence and the problem and trouble where they can get in down the line. So they accept it because of food they want at the time and they are being offered food, which is cash, where they can go do what they want to do. And probably somewhere they have been offered. Them could not turn it down, kind of like one hundred dollar, one five thousand dollar. Them could have all one nice fifty thousand, or probably one percentage of X amount will come. So them now go turn it down. But me, who not so fool, to put my freedom at risk in involving something like that with my account. Remember, you know that carry all your details, you know. So you know, not hide for hide, you know. How long you can hide for? Anyway. Make sure you go and talk because our speaker coming up. Mm? Yes, it's the same thing. This minute, yesterday, they come. Say, them never get no money. We're going to stop pick up money for these people. Say, my speaker, you're going to come go and hold it. Come speaker, speaker time. Listen. It's the very same thing. The only difference is that it's the people in um, America, the people in Canada, and the people in England. Who are using their cash up and their account to facilitate these unregistered? The same thing. It's the same thing. Up here, we are going to call it's known as banking fraud. Okay? I said that the day when I said, I, um, the young lady. This is what me I say. None of them not make one. One only more educated than the other one. But none of them not make one. And this is the thing. Because them feel like say people have it to them bright, them feel like say anything them come and say, we are gonna follow. Or them cronies and followers are gonna follow them, yes, not we. It cannot be the same thing. Because there is no criminal activity taking place. It's about criminal activity the police force is talking about. And there is no criminal activity taking place presently where cash up is concerned. You are going to tell me, say, if me have my family and me want a cash up to use, my family can I, me can I use my family cash up like how I have a, a platform like this. Me can I use my family cash up, my daughter, my sister, my woman cash up who might be living in America or Zell if them live anywhere else or Canada whatsoever. That you are going to tell me? Me can I use it? It's a fraud? Can't be a fraud. Once the money is not criminally obtained, it cannot be no form of fraud. Once I transfer X amount of money into it, it cannot be a money laundry. It's not like me using that avenue to transfer money that I solicit illegally from one means or the other. I channel it through there so because it can't come through the banking, the, 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 the banking system because they shut down the system so I put it through cash up and dash up and zell and pell. 
So it cannot be the same thing. So you come out here and mislead the people them. You know, remember you know? You know, in the top three educated person out here, you know. You have to talk about the L. Give me your L. Give me your L. Give me your K. Give me your K. Give me your V. Give me your V. Hey, hey, hallelujah. Was talking and I said, you know, it's best to get whatever advice or whatever. But it, 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 it's, it's the same thing. And watch, you know, there's a lot there's a lot going on. I'm not going to talk. I'm not going to talk too much. But if you remember, late last year, I said there's going to come a point when everything is going to come tumbling down. This is the start of it. They're not touching up yet because... Mr. McLaughlin and CTAC is aware of certain things too. That much we can't hear. Right. See so the number pin, the number is pin, okay? So call in, feel free, and if you want, step away and talk about the charity away from the bank account. Oh, yes. If you want to see us coming on and talk about it, feel free. Go on, Michelle. It is. When, remember the very first time I come by your program, and I said to you, say, what Donna is doing is not scamming, it's money laundering, right? So Jamaica, what, what, what they don't realize what's going on, Jamaica is under pressure from the US government. Money laundry. Money laundry. All on the people. Me a second. Me a go Google for them. What's the meaning of money laundry? According to FinCEN, Money laundering involves disguising financial assets so they can be used without detection of the illegal activity that produced them. Through money laundering, the criminal transforms the monetary proceeds derived from criminal activity into funds with an apparently legal source. So on the hear my people, illegal activities. What Dana is doing is no illegal activities. It's no criminal transferring no money to her for illegal activities. So who not here? I go and, I go and Google one more time. So probably who not here? Because the truck did a pass a while ago. Who not listen again? So when all them had bought them work, I laugh for them. I come out and tell people through them platform all are done. So them can't tell them anything and them follow her. What's money laundering? Here's the definition of money laundering. The concealment of the origins of illegally obtained money, illegally typically by means of transfers money. involving foreign banks or legitimate businesses. You hear? Legally obtained money. So that's like you yeah, have the criminal activities. Man, they are firing a sell the nurse and a transfer the money to yes or to this or to this. Or. That is money laundering. Alright? Continue talk. All Peace and speak, a boy has speak. Right now, with regards to these things. Alright? Them under big, big pressure. This is why when the Miss Ellis thing did come out, I You still have foreign, I know all of this. And you see them run up and down now. Some of them are going to say. Sure, no one will read it, read it. Because if you read it and know, you should say no other sense. Because they now have no books and whatever. We're still in a problem. Because we're already. Depend the on the, the radar. Yesterday when we talked, we mentioned Donna. We said not Erica alone. Da we mentioned de, Donna and da, da, names da. and people don't like come that. Come on, come on. Truth. Donna is very guilty of this. Do you and know what it means to have a revolution? Donna has been, um, and this is why we say Rushmore is also going to be in serious trouble. Because if you are not a registered cameo, you should not be collecting money. Because of that Rushmore I do. Rushmore is doing the same thing because they are collect the people their money, giving it the, the people their foreign exchange, giving it back to Donna, setting their amount as if they're, they're, they are a cameo, right? So this is why you see them say, and Erica alone involved in this thing, all of them, all of Uno, when they are foreign or whatever on the day, and are using a cash up or on the to pick up money because the cash up, I know for a fuck it. I am sure, Miss Debbie. And Mr. Crowell, who is supposed to be her husband, is a reputable and creditable business person. And I am sure, just like Dana, who makes sure she's on her P and her Q when doing anything. Especially when it has to do with money and you know, so you can't get entangled with the law. I sure know 
if them did even do it the first two three times without questioning it after the volume of how them are going to start do it where they are them seat are come where them have to do it i sure know they would have go to the requisite persons or places to query if this is okay you understand because to me they seems to be creditable and reputable persons these persons are business people have business here there if not even overseas and i sure know they're supposed to have currency account and if they are running a business and people want to stay overseas and support their business or are they going to pay to support the business the transaction have to go on to either the bank cash up or zell you understand so what the people them are going to use if they don't use cash up or zell remember business people them you know legitimate, legitimate business people them you understand when we buy online from people overseas, how do we pay? We as Jamaican, when we buy online from people overseas where we don't even know. It's not like how Dana know Miss Debbie. Most of the people them who donate don't really know Dana physically, but you understand? But there's a lot of sites and social media that we go on and spend our money with. Whether through debit, credit, Paid it, said it, PayPal, ZayPal, Cash App, Dash App, Zell, or Pell. And we spend your money with them. It's the same way these people send their money from overseas to come shop with Miss Debbie. On the other hand, where they send their money through the Cash App, which is an easier system, you know, because Miss Debbie, as I said, and Mr. Cruel, creditable and reputable persons, they must know what they are doing, as I say, if they do it for the first two, three, four times and them see the value of the house that happen, they might go and check it out afterwards. You understand? To realize and know that, okay, yes, I am doing something legal because I can't make um, two helping people have messed up my, you know, my credibility. Yes, so they must go check it out. So if people choose to send money to them, you understand? Instead of the Acklings of Western Union, which Dana is just right across from there, right across from there. I don't think nothing is wrong with that. Because the money that has been sending from overseas, it wasn't conned by anyone to say, okay, yeah man, send the money, come and see the house, yeah. I eat this man. You can't send your cousin come look on the house, you know. Yeah man, and when your cousin come. To me living at the area, I mean, no, say nobody no normally they are this house here. I come and I pull the gate because I know no dog no in here. I'm a walk around, I'm so hearted. You know, so the caretaker gone with the key, but I can't show you around the place still. Because you know, no key if you carry them in now, you know. And you carry them around and things. Probably a little one window up me, you or you can't pull a little one window. You say, yeah, man, see the house there, paint and thing and look alright. Because you already know that because your intention, you already know it. So you work out everything and plan everything. And when the person comes now, the cousin call back family and friends and say, Yeah, man, I see the house man, I never go in there, you know. I see the house man, nice man, a worse, a good all, he might live in there, alright, he might be the, the person where I collect the rent. <laughs> Boom. Money comes. And no house not there. You understand? Yes. You solicit money to false pretend. You understand what I said to you? So that's criminal act. Miss Debbie, they now do that. So when you question the woman and a talk about the woman that got in trouble, <laughs> hey, you know what? Continue. The old dog face, woman. So the same thing I'm not going to do. These people are running inside. Hold on, hold on, Mitch. Wait, wait, wait. 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 These people who are running these unregistered churches, this is why I said it yesterday, they are breaking the law, right? So when they are break the law, and when 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 Adana come out and Adana say, send the money to Rushmore, send the money to Curse by Tina, send the money to this year when you cash up, send the money to the money that, that. It's basically the same thing she's doing. She renting them bank accounts. She has used them as money mule, right? So none of them now get her from it. It's the same thing. So all who think that now when them come out and say them done with charity and re re re, 
that, that me. Which money laundering that get busted? Which entity that has been supporting criminal activity you know is public in the public eyes? Yes, it is in the public eyes. But you know? No. Because if a man put up a shed and say I do a business and it's illegal. You understand? You never know say it's illegal no. Because I didn't basically put up official sign or probably fake ID and you see you say legitimate. You understand? So with the 99 I do and you hear from the call I make. If you don't mind charge to put the people them on speaker because she want everybody to hear the people. They want to beg no put me on speaker. I don't want to take me off the speaker, take me off the live. Yes. Um yeah. Mm -hmm. And now when she did that listen and she don't like where she are here and she mad to put it on speaker and put it on the live. But she does try to respect the people them. Unless there's somebody where I beg to go help. You are gonna set this woman in a hanky panky. But as I say, from day one, I hear Dana say it to me since evening, um, yesterday evening. So it's just to believe, you can't believe, say, people is out there is that honest. I'm very few, honestly, because them say money is the root of all. But money is not the root. People make money be that. People red eye. People can't know, say, them go so boom, and them see it one dollar. Or them have this, them have a fifty dollar. And when them go to so one fifty of them up. But when them see you, them see you round the corner, they say down the road, they say you're the one. You understand? Cause them can't go so you know, unless they go fold it five times. And fold it and then flick one. But if them go so one money, see me. Unlike you, when you go so one, two, three, a three money you have. So them jealous are for you. You understand? So them start thinking all kinds of things about you. Just like even in the ghetto, yes, sir. When you live in the ghetto, you know. As a little youth to struggle and I go through your hard deals. Father God decided to give you a break in life. One way or the other, you get a break. You make use of the break where you get. And you elevate. And you start moving from down to the dirt, yes, sir. Where you can't sit down on the tree you now, so you don't mingle with the dirt and let it blow up on you. You see when that start up my feel? And them see you start drive all around like a car. <laughs> them see you start dress clean. <laughs> them see you start go to some places where you never used to can go. All kind of allegation draw upon you. And one of the main allegations you draw upon you is that you're shaky. Not to mention if the little elevator you elevate now, you start meeting new friends. Because you know in life. We all know in life. Them say they hire you. Monkey climber, the more I'm exposed, well, in other sense, yeah, the bigger you get in life, and the more people know you in life, is the higher you go. So, you have to find different type of class of people where you have to join to and you have to join to you based on whatever you're involved in. So, your friendship has to move at different levels. So, all a friend carry a woman, and I'm carrying a drop your woman, and them see man drop your woman, and them say, Lord, see man, let me tell you about it. Yes, man, I'm boyfriend that I be a man, me see my job for me. Them tell you, I'm not carrying it, you know. I be a man, I'm not for your little business partner, where, you know, have a little business and give you some work and, yeah, move yourself from one stage to the other. First thing them start say, you're shaky. Mm hmm. Them exempt from what is coming, them have it wrong. Because all of them millions there were on a sit down on social media. Yeah? Because social media on a sit down and collect them millions there. On a pay in cash up. You see, all of them, all of them people there. Because first of all, cash up does not work in Jamaica. So anybody in Jamaica we have any platform and them are pay cash up, they mean a serious problem. <laughs> they mean a serious problem. The person who they might use, Why? who for account they might use to pin the cash up, but in a serious problem up there, so and them down there are pin cash up and uh, align it with them, with them program or them platform. They mean a serious trouble too. You see, me like reason, I listen people. We have knowledge of things, 
And if you don't have the natural knowledge of things, you go out there and go seek it and you carry it to us and show it. And you have a woman who come from social media recently. Care boy, yeah, man. You have a woman who come, who come from social media recently. And I kind of like when time she come out to prove her point, she show. So we, we might not know. We not just take our word for it. Because she still can mislead me. Just like with the one you do, yes sir. What she do? If she not know it naturally from her head, she go and she do her research. And she come and she put it up on her system so you can read. Yes, we know you can't have fake sight. Yes, we know you can't have this. But at the same time, she don't need to go get a fake sight to prove nothing to nobody. Unless she encounter with a fake sight and don't know. And she makes sure tell you that she makes sure any site she go upon, she knows it at a legitimate site to prove whatever she wants to prove. And I'm going to prove I'm going to play a little part of a life that she did. Must say yesterday. Yes, I'm going to get to understand that the whole thing about this charity issue. I'm not going to play the whole life. And oh no no. It's as you know hear me say, give me your hell. Give me your V. Give me your K. Which is the three most <coughs> educated and intellectual persons right now in social media diaspora here you have a next one but she's not too up into things like that the one that chit chat chit chat but she's not like you know in the forefront right now so the one i'm talking about here is the teacher Ed Head teacher, care, whatever she wanted him. And I'm going to play a piece of her life pertaining to this charity thing. You understand? Because, let me tell you this. this. Me is not a follower, I know. Me is a leader. So, me lead myself to whatever destiny me want to lead myself to. Me lead myself to whatever me want to believe. Nobody can come in and my ears come whisper around you and say, I want to come in. And me get confused. No. When you tell me why you're saying, you tell me why you're saying, I'm going to go, so, sit down, I'm observe, I'm going to re- do my little check on my research, and then when you come show me, you lead me to the part where I can go, go check for myself, and I'm going to do that. That's me. So I'm going to play a part of your video. Just after them done chat yourself. I'm going to get a clear understanding, and then now, whosoever going to hear the, video, the whole complete video, the whole charity where she come and she approve things, because there's a little conflict going on in a social media. Where every day you find something else new. Where Lady V wants to come out and do a live. I don't really hear the whole live. I don't listen to the whole live. Just like how I don't listen to the whole head teacher live because sometimes the live is so long. You know? But it best sometimes when you listen everything to get an under full understanding. But I try to listen the more important part. You understand? Yes. And lady V do a live and saying some stuff and whatsoever. You have people out there who might say, boy, she had talk about the tree or so, and she had talk about the flowers over there, so, and ray, 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 and ray, 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 whatsoever it is. What a true, ray, ray, ray. Ed teacher K come up back and basically counteracting with factual evidence where lady V never really come out and give no factual evidence of what she is saying. You understand? This. A teacher can come out and she have factual things on her screen that you can lead to even the site and go check the site for yourself to see what she are saying if your eyes can't see well on the screen. And I seems to take on to the whole thing that she break down and stuff, which I already have understanding of a few of the things that she has said. You understand? And this is why I said, me believing at this woman of 99 so much. You understand? That if she feel me, whatever she use and feel me, I trick them trick her. You understand? Whatever she use and feel me. Say for instance, them say, boy, Lord God, them find one suitcase of money where she never declare. I trick them trick her and put a suitcase of money there just to get her out. Because me know this woman now do nothing wrong. And this is why I stand up on my feet and defend the job that she's doing. Not defending she individually defend what she's doing for the less fortunate some of them ungrateful some of them grateful 
So I'm glad to get the help. Yes, I have to defend her. Because if you have 500 more people like them, they the see them all crosses them in a phone and they are both America, England, Canada, everywhere. We are criticized Jamaica about crime rate and crime this and crime that. It would have far better off if we did have 500 more people like 99 doing what she's doing. But instead of we have 500 more people like 99 doing what you're doing, we have 500 people doing the opposite to try to tear her down. Because they don't like to see nothing good. Simple. Continue. Because the, the laws are being broken. Oh, you're all speaker. You're all roach. And why, 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 when I see the, the, the government have put a step forward now, they might get pressured from the US because, like we say, billions of dollars are coming into the, to Jamaica to these unregistered charities and they want an account fee. They need to give an account of where this money go, when this money do, and raise. US government not just a pressure Jamaica or any other Caribbean country for money laundering and stuff like that. This has been going on long before Danado charity. This is going on long before anybody else want to get involved in a charity or the charity. So now come talk about US government is getting close and a pressure Jamaica. This has been something we are going on a long time. Not just with money, but with... You understand? And You understand? So this is a long time. So this is not just why they went down and start charity. Oh. Auntie and all these things. So yes, it is pretty much the same thing, Laurie. It's pretty much the same. Right, so you say um, with Jamaican renting out them bank account, cash up and sell. To me, I agree, it's the same <laughs> thing. So you know, to say, at the same renting out. What kind of yeah, pressure you can apply? Same renting out. You are not nobody, and man. And these people with them cash you up and them sell. Apply some pressure like in times to be a lock and put in them one place. Them. Mr. Yeah, you know apply why? the pressure there well, to get where you to get from it. Wonder that now, honestly. If you say it numerous times, the people them who oh, now take up the money for start to say, oh, uno, uno never give them no money. I know them. I know them. That means them are leave uno power on their own. So it must be a money making thing for them. But not even that, you know, we're going to use Dana again. Because not for them like you yeah, we talk about Dana, but like let's say yesterday I'm mean, not afraid to talk about Dana. You can't do nothing more than talk about Dana. Dana is even more guilty than Erica because I'm sure Dana platform is a bigger platform than Erica owns. And Dana receives more money than what Erica receives, so women not going to go around the corner. Thief spell one way. So whether you have big teeth, small teeth, middle class teeth, thief spell one way. Crime spell one way. So whether there is a big crime committer or whatsoever are still. So what you got to talk about? Big platform and smart. If one wrong, the other wrong. You understand? In finding guilty of any illicit wrongdoing. But what? Now for them, not like in time we talk about Dana. Yes. You know. But guess what? You can't stop but talk about Dana. You can't help yourself, you and your friends and cronies, from talk about Dana. Oh, Dana is making who make you feel like life worth living. If you get up at the and talk, I don't call Dana name. I mean, Dana is supposed to involve in the one I talk about. Who ever watch your phone? And you know that part of the way, the battery, like them show you the battery on the screen, and you see it full and it run down. Yeah, it's like them energy going down like a battery are done. Mm -hmm. So they have to call back Dana name, revive back themselves and make the battery full again. You can't do without call Dana name. You don't know that. I go around the corner and talk. When Dana, I said to Unina, when you hear Dana come out and say, nobody can call my name, my cash up. And my Zell use for my business. Nobody can say my name, call my name. She think that by coming out and saying that she's distancing, distancing herself from what is happening. And she don't realize that there is proof and there is evidence where just like Erica, she said, send the money to Rushmore. Send, 
send the money to this Yawanya cash up, send the money to this Yawanya Zell. So she is still a part of it, right? Say that no money now come to your cash up and yours and don't make you exempt from what you're just as cheap like the rest of them. There is no comparison there with that person name where you call. Every diamond dollar that Dana get is transparent. Every cash up and sell that Dana says send money to, everybody here at home. Everybody know of it. So don't compare here. Please and thanks. Alright? Please and thanks. But guess what? No matter how the situation is, all when the person worse than Dana, you know, always want Dana to be up there being the worst person. So you know, I always have to call her name and compare. Because there's no comparison here. That woman do her things totally different from Dana. Every donor, see every dollar, every dime, every quarter, and every half a dollar that spend where them send come. Everything is transparent. You know what I say? Sometimes I don't know Dana forgot. And no make no, 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 mistake and put up her phone in her bathroom when she having her shower. And forgot to say the phone they pan live or something. The way the woman loves show everything transparently. That not go on elsewhere. And anybody who try that now she them a follow. And them a follow because of why. Them realize say, okay, this is what the people them want to see. So who follow? Still follow a good trend and who not follow? Have the motive why them not follow because it no makes sense. You gotta start it, you know, and then in between, you know, show something. You show some money will come this week and next week, you know, show that money. Once you start, you have to go continue doing it because once you stop, people are gonna think that something are going. So it's best you don't do it none at all if you have your motive. Simple as that. So you can't compare Dana with the other people, them or this individual. Right? Okay, if, if you if you if you have a cash up, or you there Jamaica and have cash up, that's the first question you want to ask Dana. So she Or you there Jamaica, you don't you don't have a US visa. You're not a citizen of the United States, you're not a citizen yeah, of Canada, you're in not America. a citizen of England. Or you there Jamaica with cash up, then you can come out and say nobody can use your cash up on your zeal. Right? She have three kids in America. We are citizens of America. Three kids. Be sure no US government can't tell her people them say she can't use her cash up. And if there's a law, you say you're working on one of the biggest law firms in America. Not just a state where they're in America. Come out with your books, come show me that. Where the US government or the department that is in control of things like that can come out, come say. Then I can't use her three kids in them cash up. All fool, you know, real germs, you know. You know, germs that they talk can't help. The money don't come in and your cash up and yours, yeah. So there's a lot more to this. And more and more things are going to come out. So I'll never say... We're not on a substance, man. We're not fight a losing battle. In this country, this is one of the battle we can't country, crash. This is one of the battle we can't you block. Cash up and yours, yeah. to, uh, to facilitate these mm. illegal charges. So we're going to have to give a country because it's banking fraud. It's banking fraud. It's banking fraud. Period. And, and, and I say. Are the to only back of this or only now crashing on social media? Period. 99. So they're going to give an account for it. They're going to give an account for it sooner or later. Sooner or later, they're going to give an account for it. Sit down and wait. And Rushmar is also going to have to give an account of why they have been using their business as a camera. What you have to do is go find a, a, a radio station or a TV station because so them say you was a farmer journalist. I don't know you. I mean, that boy watch news and they're all over social media. No social media, the media, mainstream media. I mean, I don't know you. But look at work with a radio station or a TV station. So when it busts out, you can't be the first to bring it. Because you will never get that news to carry for 99. More than the fear can pass one day. Why you put it up now why you never put it up before? What happened to the audit? Have you been cleared? Them gone for one next to my now. Have you been cleared? Is everything okay? Did you get the go ahead to continue with the charity? Those are the questions people have asked. Before you put up bank account for taking people money. 
Hey, we don't worry about everybody we are sending them money come and the people them now worry. Because it has been proven so the people them now worry because they are, they, are, they are returning donors and new donors. You force them to have them radar. Dana, they have a pan radar, you know, Dana, you see? The government has zoomed up on the radar, Dana. Because where some of your money has come from, you need to shop it out. Very well. Lady V Life, I'm going to go with Lady V Life. Yo! Anyway, my people, I'm going to play a teacher. Look at a piece of my want on the ear, where she has clarified the charity. As I said, there's a lot up at the top where I want to know for ear. But I just pick out a little part where it's important to me. So if you don't want to, you can go over YouTube. Who you want some more clarification and illegal charity and legal charity and this and that surrounding charity? She has a lot of fox. Not all fox. Not fox. Fox. Not all of Nor she. Over there. So you can go over there and pan our YouTube channel. She, I think it's Ed Teacher K, our channel name, yes. And go see. So, look out for this little piece yeah. And then, if you don't find it interested, you can go listen. If you're not interested in hearing about the whole situation surrounding charities, illegal charities, personal charities, registered charities, all about charity. Alright. Where the law is concerned, of Jamaica, you know. Okay. I'm not going to talk much during this video. Probably just a look at one thing when she said, just to make her you know, highlight it. Yes. Because I don't want the video run too long. So, listen. Organization is defined as a charitable trust or just listen, Keith. any institution, whether incorporated or not, which is whether established for a charitable purpose exclusively. Not. Listen. Or is intended to and does operate for the public and has no part of its net income or assets inuring to the personal benefit of any governing board member or settler of the organization or of any other private to any board member so that is all right so now benefit than no, 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 charity well two types of charity you can have a charitable trust or you can have an institution whether incorporated or not and i need you to pay attention to this part okay everything is on our whether screen you know so when you can go look and read for yourself in the meantime not. just go over our page yes. our channel a teacher case. all right which is established for when a charitable me talk, you know, purpose exclusively you know, nobody siding there should be no profiteering is what the rest of the truth and right and when believe in should be earning any profits or income from that type look at it there is a and there is four different types of right. categories of charities pay attention pay attention a charitable trust or an institution whether incorporated or not so when lady v come out and says there is no such thing as an unregistered charity i want you to also take a look at this this is taken from the website patman.org okay it is Breaking down the types of non-profits in Jamaica. So when you can go check out the website, I am also going to Pat tell you Mandora. that the information taken here is also directly from the Charities Act of 2013. It's just that it would have been too long-winded for me to scroll through the document to show all of this. But look. So who is interested? Can go over so there and the look for yourself. non-profits in Jamaica. All the naysayers them. Look go and go check it out. Look at the section that I have highlighted Stop for your benefit. Self be a Let dumb ass. associations in Jamaica an unincorporated association is a group of people who have joined together for a common purpose the association is not registered as a legal entity 
and does not have a separate legal entity from its members. This type of organization is often for social, religious, or political purposes. There are several advantages and disadvantages to forming an unincorporated association. So once again, the association is not registered as a legal entity. That is an unincorporated association, Lady with the Alphabet. So Lady with the Alphabet, it is not about what people love to say. It is about what exists in the law or the bylaws. It exists because of its structure. And this is what I always say to the people. Street talk, courthouse talk is two different things. The law is different from where you are chat out a road or so. And this is why you see these um, judge and even the judge them in them chamber uh, where we sit down in the chamber where try your case, them have them make a place, so them have them whole heap of books also, just like the lawyers. You understand? So street talk and courthouse talk are two different things. It is not registered as a legal entity. It is a group of people who have joined together for a common purpose. Now, of course, there's going to be some questions now about the formation of that group, but I'm going to get there. The association is not registered as a legal entity and does not have a separate legal identity from its members. This type of organization is often used for social, religious, or political purposes. There are several advantages and disadvantages to forming an unincorporated or rather unregistered charity. An unincorporated association does not have the same legal rights and responsibilities as a corporation. So a corporation is a registered charity. An unincorporated association is an unregistered charity. For example, an unincorporated association cannot own property in its own name or sue or be sued in court. You hear that? Listen carefully, not clean out on the ears. An unincorporated association cannot own property in its own name or sue or be sued in court. Yeah. However, there are some advantages to being an unincorporated association. Now, this is the reason why many of these unregistered charities, which is a term recognized by the Charities Act, not by people's feelings, pop up all over the place and why it is that it is often more favorable than going through the route of registration one it is easy to form there are no complicated legal requirements for forming an unincorporated unincorporated association so when lady with the alphabet is talking about where are your um your, your, your member your memorandum where is your articles where is your your, your code of ethics where is your 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 motto you do not need this for a unregistered charity that is the point they are not a requirement non tal they are less expensive Unincorporated associations do not have to pay taxes or fees to the government. They are more flexible. Unincorporated associations can change their rules and procedures more easily than corporations. In other words, when they do with the alphabet, is saying that I cannot just... And this is the main reason why most people don't want to register the charity. Because it comes with too much. It's not because anky panky but it comes with too much rules and regulation you know and stipulation so that's the reason why get up and go and do this and do that without consulting the president the this the that the that that's Good true afternoon. of registered charities 
It is not the case when it comes to unincorporated associations. It's not the case. Let's get it factual. Now this is different from a trust. Anyway, my people, as you hear me say, if you don't want to hear more about this whole situation, go over Ed Teacher K YouTube channel. You understand? Because there's a lot more in it. I you know more someone who is interested in the rules and the governing law surrounding charities who don't want to hear. So I'm going to go over there and I'm going to get more details. I can't play the whole light. I must say one or one or two hours live. I just go on a little snippet. You know, so all of who are talking and chatting and chatting and chat when I have nothing, we just want to see the back of the woman at 99. This is the reason why I play this little part of the life. You understand me? I said to you, no? so I just go over there, check her out, and listen. Sometimes she's very factual and she comes with her evidence. You understand? Me, a man, I like, you know, comment from people's page most of the time especially the platform holders them me don't want me to like comment from most platform holder page you understand because people intend to mix you when them see you come comment on a page and people intend to carry feelings for you because but if you and she in agree and me and none of the two of you don't have nothing and you do something where me feel like yeah me like what you do and thing and me want to comment now comment and if she where you don't agree with do something when me like me and I and me, me feel like comment, me have a comment. But me don't see how the social media thing set up. So I try to be myself when I normally would be in a real life. Just jam one away. No one again me drop a little one comment, you know? Yes man. Because sometimes you can't help yourself if I'm just a comment. Despite there is enough channel where I not really put a comment on none at all. You understand? That no say I watch them. Me do watch them. Because the whole of we have to watch one another, you know? Because guess what? Some people you might not watch when I make sense, but people will make sense at times. If I have one or two times, you have to watch them because why? Especially as a blogger, saga or a wagga, taga. You're not going to everywhere at the same time. So me can't carry something with a person never hear about you have a channel. And by watching me, you get a heads up how I go on this. And you might not watch my video if it's a person who try to get him on facts straight. I will go over to the original page go see what I go on, just like when I do. Sometimes I come in and, you know, another platform might highlight something to me and I just run to the page. And the person I talk about, whether I die sick or I show up and get my facts from it and then I make my decision. I just come play with me hear from you. You understand? Because things can splice, things can slice, things can cut. Anyway, you speak my mind, people. Big up on yourself. Thanks for watching again. Me a lad and I come out and I go on with herself for one video. Tomorrow I might do a video but a Sunday before you see that because this I do today Friday to Saturday because when I don't know, I like to do the video them I upload them in advance. That means I me know if YouTube restrict it or what. So I know what is what. That's why sometimes I have all three videos on my phone back to back. And sometimes if you don't listen, when you hear me talk about today or Tuesday and when you don't see the video all Thursday. You understand? So do the do. Like, share and subscribe to the channel. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Hit the thumbs up and hit the video. Please to watch the ads. Remember, continue to support the backup channel. You know, so my back live again come Sunday. You understand? Festive Sunday, so I prepare for it. Yes, man. And when you don't know, catch a pin in the comment section where I cast this big controversy. Coming I mean, con controversial argument in a social media. So dollar sign, life is a mission TV. Continue to support. The young entrepreneur college student YouTube channel give her a subscription if you have not yet subscribed Life with Gabby and Chevy the link pin in the comment section in our class your dollar just hit the link and subscribe big up on yourself blessings remember festive Sunday back come Sunday got the channel up and running again life is a mission TV so who not subscribe yet to life is a mission TV go hit the subscription button no